Almost two months after Lexington Mayor Linda Gorton delivered her State of the City address, an organization comprised of faith leaders countered with its own address, but its assessment was much bleaker. Dozens of people gathering outside City Hall today demanding the mayor do more to end violence that they feel is getting worse. LEX 18's Mike Valenti explains in the LEX 18 Big Story at 11. Mayor Gorton says she wants to hear ideas from the community as to how to stop the violence. Well, here's the community. Two and a half months into the new year, Lexington has seen six homicides, far too many for the people here, many of whom are part of the group called Building a United Interfaith Lexington through direct action, or BUILD for short. These killings happen all over town. No part of our city is immune. BUILD wants Mayor Gorton to implement what's called the Group Violence Intervention Strategy. It's been adopted by other cities, like Philadelphia. In 2020, that city's Office of Violence Prevention said GVI was an evidence-based approach that elevates the role community support and social services play in reducing gun violence and includes police partnering with the community. Mayor Gorton has so far resisted calls to implement GVI writing in a letter to the group today that she and other city officials worry the strategy would target communities of color and damage their relationships with law enforcement. One of the more recent excuses was she was worried it would target black men, even though there is no evidence to support that claim, even though members of the black community are the ones asking for her to implement GVI. And even though uh, she says she doesn't want to implement it because it would target as far as the black community, but it's the black community that is affected as far as the most. So to do nothing is just as bad. Cheryl Birch lost her son Jermaine to gun violence in 2009. You never get over it, you just learn to deal with it. Birch says she doesn't want other families to experience the pain she lives with now. Mayor Gorton, too, says she's committed to working with community partners to ending the violence in Lexington. Mike Valenti, LEX 18 News.